Hi, this is Westwalk here, and I'm going to show you how to change a player's color during the game. Okay, go into your actor that you want to change the color during the game. You create a rule, and I'm going to change this from the tutorial online so that whenever it overlaps or collides with actor 2, I'm going to make it so that, like a game, if you ran into somebody, it will change color for a few seconds and then go back to indicate you got hit. And I'm going to choose red since, like, whenever you get hit, you, like in a lot of games, it turns red. So I'm going to put a change attribute actor one color green. To zero. Chain, and then I'm gonna copy that, then paste it. I'm gonna make it actor one, actor one, color blue, to and put it to zero. So I'll show you here, and it changed it to red. And now. If you want it to to use the timer, you'd put in. I'm gonna put in timer. I'm gonna put my change attributes in there, and I'm gonna put four 1.5 seconds run to completion, and then I'm gonna make another one of these change attributes, and I'm gonna paste. And I'm going to put them outside of the timer attri timer behavior. Right there. Okay. And I'm going to put it, change it to 1. And then I'm going to copy the blue change attribute. Oops. Accidentally pressed. I'm going to copy the blue. And then I'm going to paste it. I'm going to pull it out of the timer behavior. And then I'm going to change it to 1. And then I'm going to put another timer behavior in. Change attribute. Change attribute. And then after... 1.5 seconds run to completion and so what this will do whenever it collides with the actor for 1.5 seconds it will change the to red and then it will go back to the original color and that's how you change it to, with the color now I'm going to show you how to change it with an image so I'm going to create rule, overlaps or collides with actor 2, change image to my red, already red image, I'm going to put a timer on it for Two seconds for 1.5 seconds. It changed it. And then to change back, I'm going to put an another timer in the rule after 1.5 seconds. Change image back to the original. And that's how you change an actor's image and color for during the game. See ya. Bye.